Hello students, today we are going to discuss your worksheet number 62, class 9th science for the date 2nd December. So in this worksheet as your chapter 4 is going on, structure of atom, today we are going to talk about the valency. What is valency of an atom and how do we find it? So as per the Bohr model of an atom, electron revolves around the nucleus in discrete orbit. Bohr ne bataya tha ki electron jo hai ek alag alag kakshao mein jo hai ghoom rahe hai. And the outermost orbit is called the valence orbit. Jitne bhi sabse bahari kaksh hai, shells hai, wo valence orbit kehlaate hai. Aur unke andar jitne bhi electron, those are known as valence electron. So the distribution of electron of an atom in a different shell as per their capacity and availability is called electronic configuration. Humne jo hai. KLMN की जो बात की थी कि किस में कितने आएंगे and the number only the number of electron in atom gets changed but the number of proton in atom remains unchanged तो सिर्फ electron का ही आधान प्रदान होता है proton की संख्या उतनी ही होती है जैसे कि sodium अगर 281 है if it lose one electron then the sodium ion whose electronic configuration will be 28 atom react with atom of other element by sharing a gaining or losing electron so as to achieve an octet in the outermost shell so the number of electrons that are shared or get transferred from one to another in order to have an octet in their valence shell is known as valency. So अगर हम इसको बिल्कुल simple भाषा में समझे, the number of electron gain or lost by an element to acquire noble gas configuration is known as the valency, because only the electrons are shared, not the protons. So different points, the maximum number of electrons that can be accommodated in the outermost shell is eight. So the valence shell that has eight electron it is set to position octet. तो जितने भी कक्ष हैं, पहले कक्ष को अगर हम छोड़ दें, तो सभी के अंदर जो maximum number of electron accommodate हो सकते हैं, these are known as eight electrons. So if the element is having the eight electron, it is said to be having the complete octet. If an atom has eight electron its valence orbit, then the combining capacity will valency will be zero. तो अगर किसी में जो है valency zero है इसका मतलब क्या है कि उसके जो आउटरमोस्ट शेल हैं उसके अंदर आठ इलेक्ट्रॉन हैं तो उसको किसी से ना तो इलेक्ट्रॉन लेने की जरूरत है ना ही वो किसी को देगा दैट्स वाई द वैलेंसी विल बी जीरो लाइक यू कैन से नोबल गैसेस हीलियम न्यून आर्गन जेनॉन क्रिप्टॉन एक्सेट्रा एटम रिएक्ट्स टू अचीव द ऑक्टेट इन देयर वैलेंस ऑर्बिट एंड दैट कैन बी अचीव बाई शेयरिंग लूजिंग गेनिंग इलेक्ट्रॉन्स विद अदर एटम सो जनरली वट दे दे लूज और गेन इलेक्ट्रॉन्स ओके बाई डूइंग सो द कम्बाइनिंग कैपेसिटी ऑफ द एटम of reactive element that is their tendency to react and to form molecules with atoms of the same or different elements in an attempt to attain fully filled outermost shell. So, kis tarah se they can get the eight electrons is known as the valency. So, steps to calculate the valency. First, write the electronic configuration of the element. If the outermost shell has less than or equal to 4 electrons in their valence shell, the same number of valence electrons is easier to lose than the 4 electrons instead of gaining 5 or more than. So, it's very simple. First, you uh, separate the electronic configuration into the atomic number into the electronic configuration. See the number of electrons in the outermost shell. If they are 1, 2, 3 and 4, then the valency and valence electron will be same. That means if outermost shell is having one electron, then the valency will be one valence electron. Valency two, valence electron. Valency three, valence electron. It will be same. But if the outermost shell is having this much number of electrons in the outermost shell, then the valency will be eight minus the number of electrons in the outermost shell. So you can see eight minus five, valency will be three, but valence electron will be five. You can see the total should come out to be 8 in every case. Here, not in this case, in the from 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, because these are the number of electrons which are lost. These are losing electron, and these are gaining. So when there is a gain of electron, the total should be 8. So here, its valency will be 2, 6 number of valence, 1, 7. So 0, 8. So in these four cases electrons are gate so total should come out to be 8. So this is how the outermost shell has more than four electrons the valence is calculated as 8 the number of valence electron. So it can be easily find it out. What is valency? The number of electron gained lost by an atom to acquire noble gas configuration. You can also write the number of electron gained lost or shared by an atom to acquire noble gas configuration. Okay. 
what will be the maximum number of electron present in KLMN? So K2, L8, M18, and N32. Write the electronic configuration of carbon and sodium. Carbon atomic number 6, 24, valency 4. Sodium 11, 281, valency 1. The atomic number of lithium, borium, and sulfur is 3516. You have to find out their valency. So when we write in shells, lithium 21, boron 23, and 286. So valency will be 1, 3, and 6. So, sorry, sorry, here in case of the sulfur, the valency will be 2 because 8 minus 6, it will be 2. Valency of lithium will be 1 and valency of boron will be 3. Thanks for watching. Do subscribe the channel. Thank you.